прям осколки на наш поселочек упали. Пиздец. Ебучие дроны. Уже четвертый, наверное. Вон взорвался. Вон взорвался, смотри. Вон он еще один. Сейчас грязь. Давайте колотить. Вон там его взорвали. Видно, прям было. Заснял. Вон он, видишь, смотри. Вон дым. Чуть-чуть рассосался, конечно, но вот это вот, вот этот вот клубочек было еще сильнее, короче, это все вот этот вот черный, черный дым. Я, короче, как только бахнула, я лежу на полу в, на кухне, вот, я поднимаюсь, короче, через пару секунд смотрю, и уже прям такой прям конкретный был. The drones of Great Britain played a key role in the advance of the Ukrainian army in the Kursk region. The Sunday Times reported this. According to the Sunday Times, the British government under the leadership of Keir Starmer deliberately decided not to hide the fact that it was supplying weapons to the Ukrainian armed forces in the Kursk region, reports. The newspaper notes that last week Starmer and Defense Secretary John Healy decided not so much to change the policy of supporting Ukraine as to change the tone and more openly recognize the degree of British involvement. An example is the fact that British Challenger 2 tanks are being used in the offensive. There won't be shying away from the idea of British weapons being used in Russia as part of Ukraine's defense. We don't want any uncertainty or nervousness over Britain's support at this critical moment and a half-hearted or uncertain response might have indicated that. We should be proud that we've donated a kit that is helping Ukraine in their defense, the newspaper quoted a British government source as saying. British politicians believe that this will convince allies to help Ukraine more. In addition, it will make the British public realize that the country's security and economic well-being depend on events on the battlefield. The Sunday Times notes that tanks are not the only British weapon used by the Ukrainian armed forces in the Kursk region. The Ukrainian military also uses drones, but their type is not specified. Previously, the use of Malloy drones was known. They are not combat drones but are intended to provide troops or evacuate military personnel. <laughs> 